सेंटर ऑफ मास ऑफ ए डिस्क विथ होल ए वेरी वंडरफुल क्वेश्चन एंड वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर जेई पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू सी हियर वी गॉट ए डिस्क ए थिन सर्कुलर डिस्क ऑफ रेडियस आर एंड मास एम सपोज इन दिस डिस्क वी क्रिएट अ होल बाई कटिंग आउट ए स्मॉल डिस्क ऑफ रेडियस स्मॉल आर एंड हियर सी इज द सेंटर टू सेंटर डिस्टेंस डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द सेंटर ऑफ द ओरिजिनल डिस्क एंड द सेंटर ऑफ द स्मॉल डिस्क और सेंटर ऑफ द होल हियर स्मॉल एम इज द मास ऑफ द स्मॉल डिस्क दैट हैज बीन कट एंड रिमूव फ्रॉम हियर टू क्रिएट द होल नाउ वॉट विल हैपन सेंटर ऑफ मास सी इनिशियली द सेंटर ऑफ मास ऑफ दिस डिस्क वॉज लोकेटेड एट द जोमेट्रिक सेंटर बिकॉज ऑफ इट्स परफेक्टली सिमेट्रिकल शेप बट नाउ आफ्टर मेकिंग द होल द सिमेट्री ऑफ द डिस्क हैज गॉट डिस्टर्ब्ड द सेंटर ऑफ मास इज नाउ नॉट लोकेटेड एट द जोमेट्रिक सेंटर इट विल बी शिफ्टेड समवेयर एल्स सो फाइंड द लोकेशन ऑफ द सेंटर ऑफ मास ऑफ द डिस्क विद द होल let us proceed here in this diagram capital m is the mass of the whole disk before making the hole important to note down here before making the hole initial mass of the disk is equal to m and small m here is the small m it is the mass of the disk taken out of the bigger disk okay this small disk taken out has mass small m capital r is the radius of the big disk shown here and a small r is the radius of the small disk cut and removed so a small r is the radius of this small disk taken out and c is the center to center distance that means this distance here so we have to derive a formula for such a condition okay now we are looking at the disk from the top view here is our disk a is the center of the bigger disk and b is the center of that small disk that has been cut and thrown away or we can say now b is the center of the hole and c is the distance between the centers a and b radius of the hole or the radius of the small disk removed is small r and radius of the bigger disk is capital r so where is the center of mass here the formula the formula for the center of mass for cut bodies is with a minus sign like you might remember that x coordinate of center of mass has formula m1 m2 plus m1 m2 divided by m1 plus m2 here the plus sign gets re replaced with minus whenever we have anything cut and removed so capital m into capital x minus small m into small x divided by m minus m is the x coordinate of center of mass let's understand the meaning of all these terms in the formula here capital m is the mass of the whole disk before making the hole as already explained and it is a small m is the mass of the disk taken out of the hole the mass of this small disk taken out and then capital x notice here capital x small x capital x is the x coordinate of the center of mass of the big disk when no hole was created and small x is the x coordinate of the center of mass of the small disk and this x cm is the center of mass of this disk with the hole understand difference between xcm and capital x capital x is the center of mass of the big disk before the hole was created okay so now what is the value of capital x capital x is the x coordinate of the center mass of the big disk before the hole was made so before the hole was made its center mass was exactly at its geometric center over here that means x equal to 0 capital x 0 and the small x which is the center of mass of the small disk which is located at the point b so its x coordinate means distance from the origin that is equal to c then capital m here in the formula it is the mass of the whole disk which is m and small m which is the mass of the disk which is taken out from this hole that is unknown to us we have to calculate it let us go to the next page to calculate that what is the mass of the disk that was removed from this hole so find the mass of the small disk see here the disk removed from this hole let's find out 
we will use the concept here known as the surface mass density. As you know, surface mass density is defined as the mass per unit surface area. So, the mass of this disc is capital M and the surface area will be pi r square. It is a circle. Sigma is the symbol for surface mass density. Greek letter sigma is equal to mass upon area. So, area of this circular disc is pi r square, pi capital R square. So, this is the surface mass density sigma. Now, coming to this side here, calculation of the mass of this small disc. So, from the same formula, surf, see here, so what is written? Surface mass density is mass upon surface area. By cross multiplication, we can say mass is density into area. So, mass is equal to density into area. Okay. So, mass of this small disc is the density of this small disc into area. Now, interesting thing to note is that density of the small piece and big piece both are equal. Why? Because both of them are made of same material. Okay, density does not depend on the shape and size. So, here mass means small m, the mass of the small disc. Surface mass density sigma which is same as this one and into the surface area of the small disc which is pi small r square. Putting the value of sigma over here, pi and pi will get cancelled and we get the answer that capital M into small r square by capital R square as the mass of this small disk. Now we can go back to our formula and substitute this value. So here was our formula and we already said that if this formula capital X is known as 0 at small x is known as c, but the only thing was that to know the values of capital small m. So, small m is now found out like this. So, now let us substitute the values into this formula. We know all the four things. Let us proceed. So, here is the formula and here is our data. Simply plug all the numbers into this formula. So, x c m is equal to capital M put here and capital X would be 0 right here. Small m is this much value mr square by r square and x which is nothing but the distance of the center of mass of the hole or small disc which is equal to c put here c and capital m value is capital m and small m is mr square by r square then next step we simplify this so in the numerator we get 0 and minus this which over here and from denominator you take m common from both the terms in the bracket you get 1 minus r square by r square which simplifies like this and then this r square r square cancel this mass m m cancels and notice here minus sign here is the final answer in fact this is a very good formula that we should remember okay because in the exam the distance from center to center c can be given different the radius of the hole can be made different it's not necessary all questions would have same value so, therefore, it is recommended that we should remember this formula. So, here is the formula and this corresponding diagram. Please remember the formula along with the figure. So, if we have a disc with a hole and the distance between the centers is C, then here is the C located in the numerator and a small r is the radius of the hole and capital R is the radius of the full disc. So, this formula will give you the center of mass of this kind of disc with a hole. Now, notice this minus sign. Why is minus sign here? Why negative answer minus sign? Because center of mass always lies nearer the heavier mass. That means, negative means negative coordinate means what? This is the zero coordinate. Negative to this side. Left side negative. So, the center of mass will be located somewhere here on the negative x-axis. So, because center of mass always lies nearer to the heavier mass. Now, you see, look at the y-axis. This y-axis divides this disc into two pieces. You will notice that on the right side of y-axis, mass is less. On the left side of y-axis, mass is more. Because on the left side, it is the full half disc. But on the right side, we have the half disc and minus some mass from here. So, definitely the mass on the left side of y-axis is more then the mass on the right side of y axis. So, therefore, center of mass will shift to the left side or to the negative side because center of mass will be always lying nearer to the heavier mass. 
so that is the explanation and students this is a very good formula that you can remember and apply to any such question very quickly so thanks for watching please like the video and please comment something and please share also and subscribe also thanks again